Hello everyone, Bridget Air here with All About the Grace, and today is my Valentine's show. So, um, I have some really awesome things for you today. Things that you can share on your social media. I've got some free Valentines, and I also have some great resources to strengthen your marriage if you happen to be married. If you haven't subscribed, please do click subscribe. I'm actually over 400 subscribers, which is really, really awesome. Thanks for everybody that's tuning in. Okay, I wanna get right into my topic today, Valentine's Day. I saw this really super cool thing in my local Catholic newspaper, and it gave me an idea of what I could um, share with you. So I wanna show you what I saw in our local newspaper, The Catholic Moment. It is sharing Christ's love on Valentine's Day. In this edition, there are all these cut out valentines which i thought was super cool super cute with scriptures so this gave me an idea to create digital valentines i love to send valentines to people and i also love to evangelize and there really aren't that many catholic valentines out there so that's why i created these so i'm going to go over to my desktop i can show you what um, is available for free to download so we'll go over there right now Okay, so here I am over at my desktop and I wanted to show you a couple things that I created just for you. Uh, here is my uh, website. It's my blog. It's called All About the Grace. And it's just allaboutthegrace.com up here. So you do that and you'll see my logo here. And here are the Valentines. Okay, so here's my little picture of the first Valentine. Um, also, you can subscribe over here too. Just put in your email address and you'll get, um, you'll receive my posts. So here, here they are, Valentines for you to share. Are you looking for Catholic Valentines to share with your friends, family, or significant other? Well, below are free downloadable Valentines for you. So you can actually download these and print them if you wanna pass them out that way or mail them to people. Um, you can share via text, email, or social media. Uh, compliments of All About the Grace. So here they are. I have, I believe I created 12 of them. So you just pick the one or all of them that you want and you just download it. You just click it, you download it, it'll go right down to your device. And then you can either print it or you can share it digitally. So I tried to make a variety. I, I tried to make some that were for kids. Um, pretty much for all age groups. Um, so take a look here. I actually had a blast making these too. We've got this row. So I've got a mixture of scripture, mixture of things for kids or for really any, any age. If you like these, you can, you can share you can use these share buttons to share any of these with anybody. And if you ever want to connect with me on my social media platforms, you can do that over here. So this is how you follow me over here. If you want to do that, this is where you subscribe right here. Okay. You can donate. That'd be great. If you want to support this ministry, subscribe to. So there you go. I really hope that you enjoy these. I had a lot of fun making them and I hope you can share the love of Jesus and the love that you have for your friends, family, and significant others using these Valentines. I'm glad, I'm glad I showed you those. I'm super excited about those. Okay, well I have some other resources I wanna share with you. I am actually in a couples group and we're using this really interesting book this is a resource for married couples. Discernment of Spirits in Marriage. This book is really fascinating. I really want to recommend it. It talks about basically how the devil works to undermine your marriage and things that you may not even be aware of. And I know evil is a really popular topic because I did an interview with Father Vince Lampert. I've done a couple interviews with him but my YouTube interview is like over 17,000 views right now and it, it just keeps climbing. So there's a fascination with evil. This book talks about 
Ignatian spirituality, Saint Ignatius, and he had these rules to for life, but also to discern spirits, good and bad spirits. So this book actually applies those rules to marriage. It's a great book. I highly recommend it. It's by Sophia Press, and you can just Google it, Discernment of Spirits and Marriage. It's by Father Timothy Gallagher. Really interesting book. So I want to recommend that. Maybe that could be a Valentine's gift um, for your significant other if you happen to be Catholic or Christian. Okay, another resource I want to share with you, The Messy Family Project. And they have something starting up for Lent, which is coming up really soon. It's called Cana 90. That is a program that you can get in on that will help you strengthen your marriage and family life during Lent. I also want to mention that I will, in this, in the description of this video, I have interviewed some of these people that I'm talking about their resources. I will put the links to those interviews to get more depth into the topics that I'm talking about, the resources I'm offering you today. So you can look in the description for that. And then another resource is the third option. And that is a marriage resource that's it's national and actually international. We have it here locally in the Indianapolis metro area. It's basically a series of classes that teach you how to communicate with your spouse. So the third option, some people when they're, maybe their marriage isn't going that great or they're disillusioned in their marriage, they think maybe that there's only two options, stay in an unhappy marriage or get divorced. Well, that's kind of how the third option came about and that's reconciliation. That's the third option. And so in these series of classes, it shows you how to be a better spouse. And right now, at least um, the third option in Carmel, Indiana, I think it's called thirdoptioncarmel.org, they're actually doing those online via Zoom. So you may not even need to be in the area to take part in that. And the couples locally are great, I have to tell you. They're really awesome. I interviewed them, and I will put the link to that. Uh, the other resource I want to give you is, I think it's really funny, a lot of people in Catholics, Christians, and people in the secular world, we celebrate all these saint holidays like St. Patrick's Day, the Feast of St. Nicholas, but a lot of people in our culture don't know a ton about the particular saint because the, the holidays kind of been secularized. So I wanted to share with you a video I made on St. Valentine to show you a little bit about him if you don't know anything about him. I made this little video for you, so here it is. you enjoyed that and uh, thank you so much for tuning in if you haven't clicked subscribe please do click subscribe it helps me out a lot in terms of just sh saving me time uh, also if you haven't gotten a copy of my book called breaking new ground discipleship using new media and it's really about how to share your love of Jesus on a digital platform gives you lots of tips. I hope you can pick that up. You can pick it up on Amazon or you can email me and I can get you a signed copy because I have some here at my house. So thanks so much for tuning in. God bless you and until, uh, until next time, happy Valentine's Day. God bless.